Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm showing a wonderful program that I happen to use, and this is only applicable for iPhone users. It's iFreeUp. What it does is delete junk file and try to speed up your phone performance. And basically, this is under iobit. It's been quite useful. On my phone, it feels better, as in doesn't lag anymore like used to. It feels a little bit much better actually, but I haven't get a chance to try out the pro version. And today I'll be exploring this wonderful application just for Apple users. And I'll be right back. Sorry, I have to mute my mic a while because I'm drinking my coffee. And does this application work with iPad and any of your devices from your Apple device? Uh, yes, it does. Only for handheld devices for Apple and for Mac is different. Since I don't have a mic, I cannot try. And there's a file manager. You can import any file or export any pictures. Music. And pictures. If I want to export, I can export. But I'm not going to use it. And what is good is you can change your devices, you can find it here. My device is 128GB, which is bigger, so I can listen to song with. Anyway, time to close this out. And major issue is this is for Windows 7 and Windows 8 the program but if you want to use it on your Windows 10 yes can you just download the iFree app right click on it if it's really installed on your PC first
and my computer start to freeze a little bit since I haven't got a time to boot up my computer I'll be right back when the thing is working again And I'm back today. As you can see, you can go to right click on the menu, go to property, and go to capability and capability mode. You need to check on it and click on here you will be seeing a Windows 95, Windows 7, Windows 8 well you can click on Windows 7 click on apply and click on ok and you should be seeing this load up best recommendation is go to the means those seven mode instead and what is majorly taking note is uh, regarding this application you need to have a window with uh, iTunes 11 version 11 and above to use it you need to have iTunes install and iFreeUp will be working successfully so take it as you wish and have a nice day and just before I forgot anything I will be going to the website And there we go, the, the official website. And this is the requirement, 25.9 megabyte, version 1.09, require Windows 8, Windows 7, Visita and Windows XP, SP3 and iTunes 11 Plus. And you can use the support tab And there you go, USB connecting issue can have many organs generally Generally speaking, the issue is the same in iTunes and affect I free up if an Apple mobile devices fail to show up in I free up it might well be an issue with the devices on the computer itself. You can make it an Apple mobile devices issue if you open iTunes and see the device not does not show up in there either well this is major issue if you are not detecting your devices here you can go to disconnect your iPhone devices and reconnect try again uh, you can check iTunes can recognize your devices if there is a passcode you can you need to unlock it first if it still doesn't doesn't work, reboot both the computer and devices. If nothing of this work, launch iTunes and go to menu help and click check for update. Try to launch 
I free, I free up again. And there's a Mac version if you're using a Mac. Up, oh, take as you wish, and 